I get it. They're weird things. I'd like to know what's in them, too. But we don't have that kind of time or resource. So no. And please stop asking. Fast one on us. Priceless relic. The key we have been searching for. Except, of course, it's fake! I thought it was the real deal, Ravis. Honest! Oh. I believe you. 
But mistakes like these cannot be tolerated. Let this be a reminder of what happens when you cross the Bedlam Raiders! Kill him. Oh no! No! Enough. Walk away. A Jedi. <laughs> Remind our friend here why his kind are supposed to be dead. Jedi Knight, if you stay your hand, I shall withdraw in peace. Be seeing you. This is him, Doma. This is the one who stood up to the Bedlam Raiders. All right, that, that's enough, Turgo. Turgo, Get over here. Yes. You're Doma? Well, yes, I am. You got a name, Jedi. I'm Cal. This is Speedy One. <laughs> We'd, uh, appreciate if you kept this quiet. Mm -hmm. Well, out here on the frontier, only way we survive is by sticking together. That's right. You didn't have to step in just now, but you did. Yes, you did. Turgle, mm. shut it. Mm. We'll keep your secret safe. Cal. I'm sure we could both benefit from it. Thanks. Mosey is one strong woman. Heard she took a job towing starships. With her back.
if you're dying of thirst, but a drink they ain't the worst. And if you're running from a blaster, better run a little faster. Run to Pi Loon Saloon, and we hope we see you soon. Potential customer. What'll it be? Nothing. Thanks. Oh, well, that's a mistake. I'm looking for an old friend. Four arms. Hairy. Big mouth. Ow. Vertically challenged. You can come out now, old boy. The coast is clear. I tell you, Monk, the Bedlam Raiders are gonna be the end of this town. We got no hope. Zero. Zilch. Nothing. How you doing, BD? Ah. Wait a minute. Cow. Cal, can't just get over here, you son of a bugling! Oh, 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 it's been a while. I missed you, kid. Hey. Let me look at you. <sighs> you look terrible. Yeah, it's good to see you too, Grease. <laughs> hey, are you taking care of him? <laughs> are you taking care of the manis? Well, uh, we ran into some trouble on our last job. What sort of trouble? The Imperial kind. Oh, yeah, I should have guessed. They've been creeping around Kobo, too, lately. Gyro's burnt out on the Mantis. We'll need your help to get moving again. Yeah, sure, whatever you need. Come on, grab some seed. Listen, Monk, get my friend something special to drink. Refreshments. One slippery Monk coming right up. Welcome to Pilude Saloon, the finest dive this side of Zaltrout. <laughs> yeah, your description, uh... Didn't do it justice. Here's sand in your eye. Monkey and I picked it up from the previous owner to a, well, a, well... He caught a fatal case of blaster poisoning, courtesy of the Bedlam Raiders. We've been introduced. You okay, Grease? Oh, yeah, sure. <laughs> as long as I don't have anything they need. Hey, what happened to the Manus? Oh, we are on Coruscant, gathering intel for Saw Gerrera. Things got bad. Only two of us made it out. Everything I'm doing feels pointless. The Empire's only growing stronger. Things, uh... haven't been the same since the team split up. Yeah, hey, we had some good times, didn't we, huh? Me, you, the Space Witch, Seer. Have you talked to her lately? Marin's always on the move, exploring new places. Making new friends. I was talking about Seer. No. It's been a while. You? Well, her credits helped us get this place off the ground, but she hasn't visited yet. She's very busy with this new project. <laughs> hey, Gal. Why don't you relax a little before we fix the Manus? The galaxy can wait a couple hours. Well, we should probably get moving as soon as we finish up. I got a spare room down in the basement made up especially for you. You should check it out. All right. Thanks, Grace. <laughs> Must not get a lot of business here. You don't look like a raider. What gave it away? No blaster in my face. No spilling drinks and shouting bloody murder. Oh, cute droid, too. That's BD-1. I'm Cal. About dang time we had some new faces in town. I'm Zig, by the way. Nice to meet you. There's the kitchen. Basement must be through here. Kobo's pretty far from the nearest trade route. Looks like Grease makes do with salvage.
Come on, buddy. That Sears Halleck set. Wonder why it ended up here. My old scrapper outfit. Why did Grease keep this? I know. Creepy. Grease always had a green thumb. You know he talks to his plants? Talk it in your sleep, huh? Guess some things never change. Weirdo. Hairball. <laughs> Thanks for letting me crash here. Of course. Why do you think I've kept your stuff around all these years? I was hoping you'd stop by and maybe take a break. We both know what happens when I stay in one place too long. You said there's a spare gyro around here somewhere? We've got plenty of time to fix the madness. You are what I want to talk about. I'm fine. The sooner we get moving, the better. And then what? You're going to go find some trouble with Saw Guerrera? Maybe. Yeah. One of us has to keep fighting. That's funny. That's the exact same thing you said the day we all split up. Yeah, because I... All right, listen. I know you all had your reasons for leaving. But walking away isn't an option for me. I have to hold the line. And where's that gotten you, Cal? Look, I wish things were different, but you keep losing people. And you yourself said that the Empire is growing stronger every day. Now, maybe it's time for you to be something more than a lightsaber. Think about yourself. Settle down. Find a home. What? Home, Grease. There is no home. Home was the order. It was my teacher. It was everyone I lost. What does their sacrifice mean if I go and I just give up and stick my head in the sand? I know you were dealt a bad hand, but you got to take it from me. Somebody who had to learn the hard way. You got to know when to walk away from a rigged game. Otherwise, you are going to end up losing something you could never replace. Now you go ahead and look. I keep a lot of spare parts down there. I'm sure you'll be able to find whatever you need to get the manis up and running. Thanks. I appreciate all this. Kyle, can I tell you one thing? It's really good seeing you again. Yeah, you too. Grease. I'll think about what you said. Hey, uh, watch your step down there. Be careful. <laughs> I definitely have a pest problem. Smuggling tunnels, huh? Grease always kept a few secrets up his sleeve. What's that?
Foglings? Are these what spook grease? I don't bite, I promise. used these tunnels for a long time now. Dusty and abandoned. More scraps, huh? Leave it to Grease to take another person's junk and add more junk. locked. the sooner we can. We should check this out. Let's stop. It almost reminds me of the Jedi training grounds, but it feels different, older. Let's look. Find something? Power 
are still running down here. Let's see if we can hit the lights. What's that? Careful, BD. I came as soon as I could, Master Cree. I'm sorry it has come to this. Will it be a complete memory purge? No. Only what the Council demanded. Then at least, I shall remember you. I am ready. What is your name, droid? I am ZNA4, of course. How may I serve the Order? Z. Tell me how to navigate the Kobo Abyss. I have no information on that in my memory banks. Master Kree, you are aware the Republic has issued a full-scale evacuation order. I am. Um, that is why I have a very important task for you, Z. Take this. A tuna? Oh, what a fine model. Travel underground. Stop for no one. That is an order, Z. Am I not coming with you? No. The key to Tanalor is in that array. If you do not hurry, I fear it will be lost forever. May the Force be with you. has been here for hundreds of years. This is BD. We're gonna help you. Pleasure to meet you both. Some help would be most appreciated. I'm a Jedi, all right. But you're not even wearing the proper robes. I'm more of a poncho guy. Really knows. This droid's got more than a screw loose. 
What was that? I, uh, said, hold tight, Z. Looks like a data disk. Never took them. I was knighted in the field. And what was the reason for this flagrant breach of protocol? It's a long story. Take a look. Well, I, I must admit, I am in need of repair. <laughs> for now. Just gotta figure a way out of this place. Well, I can help with that. It's this... Was it that? No. Oh! Yes, it is this way. Follow me. Oh, now I see where we are. A meditation chamber. Master Kree designed these to train Jedi. I remember this. Don't recall what it does, however. Master Kree had a brilliant mind. Do you know her, Cal? Can't say I do. No matter, but I think she would have liked you. The exit is this way. I am very fortunate you came along when you did. Yeah, we could have been down here forever. That planet you mentioned. What's it like? Tanalo? Oh, what a wondrous place. How do I get there? Navigate the Kobo list. That must be the knowledge your master purged from your memory banks. Well, she must have had her reasons.
since the last time I stood here. And the sky was full of meteors. Oh, I have been asleep for a very long time, haven't I, Cal? Yes. Don't worry. You're not alone. We'll help you get back on your feet. You might not be wearing a proper attire, but... Now I am certain you are a Jedi. Come on. I'll be there in a moment, Cal. Don't wait on my behalf. Oh, such strange buildings. Oh my, what is that? I'm not a Bedlam Raider spy. I'm a friend of Cal Kestis. Cal, what's it? Look, I told you, buddy, you're in the wrong cantina. I don't know anybody named Cal Kestis. Hey, Grease. Oh, that Cal Kestis. Found the gyro. You made it. Good to see you, Cal. Grease Dritus, this is Bodakuna. He was on Coruscant. Wouldn't have made it out alive without his help. Oh, all right. Hi, nice to meet you. Unfortunately, I don't think I have another bed available. Wait a minute. Another one? Cal, you have a very bad habit of picking up strays. I am ZNA4, humble servant to the Jedi Order. Oh, I take it you haven't broken the news yet. She was trapped underground. I've never seen this design before. This droid almost looks like an antique. Did you find anything down there worth credits? Credits? <laughs> Cal, you have saved me, but... I must ask more to you still. Oh, here it comes. Master Centauri ordered me to open the forest array, but given my condition, I cannot fulfill that duty. Please. If I fail my mission, the key to Tanalor may be lost forever. Wait a minute. Did you just say Tanalor? You've heard of it? Yeah, it's an old prospector's legend about a lost world filled with treasure. Maybe this droid proves it's more than a myth. Could be worth checking out. Yeah, but first, I gotta fix the menace before the raiders snatch it. I'll escort you out there. Watch your back while you make the repairs. Oh. Is he as tough as he looks? Next to Seer, he's the best marksman I've ever met. Okay. We'll take care of the manis. I'll go see what's in the forest. Thank you, Cal. As soon as I am in full operating order, I will join you at the forest array. Onward! Uh, Z. Whoa there, Heritage. While they're all sallying forth, why don't you ease up on the thrusters? Come along. I can get you tuned up, shined up, and, uh, <clears throat> caught up on the state of the galaxy. Cal, I'm gonna lock up the saloon so the raiders don't trash it. My Use the back door, would you? Relax. You're in safe hands. You'll be all right, Grease. 